Saints welcome in the hot swinging West Georgia Wolves for a Tuesday night non-conference matchup. And in the first inning, the Wolves would flux their muscles as they would put five runs across on the starter Jesse Coxwell and Alex Simmons, and they take their early lead five to nothing. Things not looking good for the Saints right off the bat in the first inning. But in the bottom half, Jordan Ayersman will lead things off, and he goes into left center field for a deep double, and he would come around and score a couple of batters later on a Troy Snitker poke into right field. So the Saints get on the board 5-1. to one. Not yet done, though, in this inning. They'll get end up with two more runs, including a Kenny Bellavance RBI single and a Chad Sage RBI ground out 5-3 to three now. We go to the second, but the Wolves strike yet again. This time in the left center field off of Alex Simmons. Dustin Carpenter can't get to it, and it's a triple for Speronis, and West Georgia puts two on the board. 7-3 to three now. They take the lead to the bottom of the third inning. That's where the Saints, though, would continue to pour on the runs. One comes in on Terrell Jones, hitting from the left side. He'll play one. Then it's Chad Sage with a rope in the left field. Seven to five. Here comes the Saints. And then it's Brad Hall with the Saints down by two. Two men aboard, and the ball goes deep in the left center field. It's a moonshot, and the Saints take their first lead of the ball game, eight to seven. This is an old Wild West shootout. Top of the seventh inning now. Wolves will strike again. Two runs come across in the home run run by Garrett May and the Wolves back in front now. Saints trying to answer in the bottom half. It's Terrell Jones at it again up the middle. Jordan Ayersman racing home. Here comes the throw just in time. Jordan will beat it out with a head first slide and we're tied at nine apiece. Bullpen settled down from there the next two innings. Bottom of the ninth inning. Nobody on, nobody out. Alan Fredrickson, he's the go-ahead game-winning run. Lead-off double. He advances now to third. A couple of batters later. It's Terrell Jones, this time from the right side with the bases loaded. Ground ball, left side with one out, and there's no play for Garrett May. The shortstop, Saints with a walk-off win, 10-9 your final as the Saints get their 30th win of the 2011 season. A couple of players to note from the ball game. Terrell Jones, 3 of 5. He had the game-winning hit with three RBIs, average now at 340. Brad Hall, the bull with a three-run shot to put the Saints in front in the middle innings. And Daniel Warzon gets to win going two and two-thirds with a couple of strikeouts. Saints will welcome in Flagler this weekend. We'll have the call right here for you on the North Georgia Saints broadcast network.